Hey guys, Jeb here, and today I've got a short little 20 gun streak video for you, and this class was actually suggested by Ragnarok. Uh, I'll leave a picture on screen of what he actually suggested, and he wanted me to basically get a decent little gameplay with it. This was actually a 10 minute gameplay, but I cut it down because most of the kills was in this little 3 minute time span where I actually get the, I think, Relentless Metal, which is a 20 gun streak plus a Swarm Dogs and VSAT. So I went ahead and cut it down, make it a whole lot simpler for me, because I'm still trying to pump out Arlie's road to commander videos the setup is pretty good though I actually like switching the EOTech off and putting on stock um, it makes the type 25 a good weapon the type 25 is basically the scorpion of the assault rifle class it empties its clip very fast so I always try to run fast hands on it now I want to actually talk to you about how y'all actually enjoying these road to commander and the new minecraft survival episodes I'm enjoying putting them up, reading the comments and everything. There's a couple good games that I've already posted so far, and a couple bad ones, and I, I'd like to thank you for the support, because the first episode I put out was a negative gameplay, and the fact that y'all really didn't care and that y'all would learn from my mistakes was awesome. Like, I was expecting some bad comments, maybe some dislikes or whatever, but y'all, like, pulled through and did awesome on that video, just... That's why I'm keep posting. I'm really enjoying this whole YouTube thing right now. It's fun for me. I'm putting up two videos a day. At one point, I was only putting up three videos a week. Now I'm putting up probably around 14, uh, being either two Road to Commander episodes a day or Minecraft Survival and a Road to Commander. So the schedule is basically two Road to Commanders every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday, and then uh, one Road to Commander and a Minecraft Survival every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. So it's still going to take me a while to actually pump out all these Road to Commanders. Like I said, I think there's 84 or 85 different games. Some of y'all want me to actually put two of them in one episode, but the thing is, my internet is kind of uh, on the bad side, so... It takes me a while to upload these videos, usually at least an hour and a half, sometimes upwards of two hours. And with the Minecraft survival video, some people want 15-minute uh, episodes. I tried to only stick around 10, but I'm going to see if I can do the 15-minute because that takes about three, three and a half hours to upload it. But what I'm going to do is just upload it overnight, set it as scheduled, and let it come out about 2 or 3 p.m. the day it's supposed to be released. So it does make it a whole lot simpler doing it that way. That way I can actually have longer episodes, and I really won't have to worry about it because actually it took for the first session of minecraft when me and Tass sat down it was an hour and 15 minute session it took seven episodes because i did most of them in uh 10 minute sections but we've already done session two so i'm thinking about just going ahead and rendering all in 15 minute sections and uploading them to you guys make it a whole lot simpler for me and you that way i can actually make more minecraft videos whereas right now i'm sitting here waiting on the sessions to actually be cut up and everything because I have very limited hard drive space at the moment. I've ran out. At one point during this whole Road to Commander, I had like 80 gigs of hard drive space I had to use for the entire Road to Commander. And I found myself deleting other little gameplays here and there. Uh, what I shouldn't keep and what I should keep. But this kill streak is about to come to an end here. Uh, basically, I'm looking around for C because we have triple capped and everything. And what ends up killing me off my relentless streak is a guy with a B23R. Now, they've been nerfing weapons, they've been tuning everything, and I still don't understand why they haven't touched the B23R. That gun is better than the Chikum, and the Chikum one is a submachine gun. Why is it that a secondary pistol outguns most things at point blank range? So. Hopefully they'll nerf it in the future. I would love to see it just get kind of like a nerf for a fire rate. But uh, other than that, I hope you all guys enjoyed this. Peace out.